Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Young Blood Reviews, and I'm here to do my in my mailbox this for this week. So that I got a lot of good books. So let's get down to it. The first book I got was The Hunger Pains by the Harvard Lampoon, and this is a parody of The Hunger Games. And these people also wrote Nightlight, which is a parody of Twilight. And they're very funny when they write parodies. And I enjoyed Nightlight, and I can't wait to start this one because I've already read like the first page of, of one of my friends when he brought it to school and it, it was really funny at the beginning. I also got an advanced reader's copy of Thumped which was given to me by a friend. This is the second book in the Bunked series. I think that's all there's going to be is it's, it's a series of them, I'm guessing. But very excited to read this. I haven't read Bumped yet which I need to which is kind of weird since I got Thumped so. Yeah. I also got Berserk by Michael Grant. I was very skeptical about this book. I did not know if I wanted to get it because this book sounded really confusing. And on the back and on the front, I love the I love the saying. It says, "In this war, there are only two outcomes: victory or madness." And there's a book is always good if it involves madness. Um, there's gonna be a second one to this. But I'm hoping I like this one. I've, I've heard a lot of good reviews on it. And I also got The Secret Circle, The Divide by L.J. Smith. And what really made me mad when I got this book, it says, like, right up here, it says, written by uh, Aubrey Clark. So I'm guessing that's the ghostwriter's name. But this is the fourth book in the... Well, not the fourth one. Technically the third one. I don't know. But it's a sequel to The Secret Circle. And there's also The Secret Circle, The Captive, and The Initiative. Or not The Initiative, but something else. And there's two books out, and they're two volumes with four, with two books in each. So, yeah, I got that one. Very excited to get that one. And the next one comes out, on my, comes out close to my birthday, September 11th. So I'm very excited. And that one has, this one has a very beautiful cover. I like it. And that's all for me this week, but I'm going to show you what I, now I'm currently reading. Thanks to my one of my best friends, Bookwire Review. Go and check them out. Link will be link will be down in down below. I'm currently reading "Take a Bow" by Elizabeth Yulberg. This book I am already 78 pages into. It is really really good, and it comes out around April April 1st. And I would go get it. I really recommend it. If you if you're like a a fan of Glee or like any musical I would definitely go check this out it, it's probably gonna be a five star depending on how the rest of it goes but yeah I'm enjoying it and also I wanted to show you this guys since the Hunger Games came out this week I got my Hunger Games identification card you really can't see it that good but yeah that's my Hunger Games identification card and I also got my shirt, and sorry, it's a bit, it's a bit wrinkled, but, because I've worked the movie, and it says, may the odds be ever in your favor, and then it shows my district on the back, and my name. I am District 3, which is technology, I'm not really happy about that, because I don't like District 3, and from the movie, <laughs> District 3 made me mad, because they did not represent us well. I have to say. Well, that's all for me this week. Guys, leave down in the comments. Leave a link to your in my mailbox. And I'll see you guys at the end of this week. Happy reading.